Thank you, Mr Speaker. May I first thank the House and you, Mr Speaker, for allowing me to table my valedictory speech. As most members would be aware, I had throat cancer treatment, radiation chemotherapy in March of 2018. Additionally, early this year, I contracted COVID, which left me with a vocal cord palsy, which makes it difficult to speak and why my voice is so rough. Like what happened to the former Premier, Neville ran after his throat operation many years ago. Mr Speaker, I wish to thank all members of this House for their friendship and camaraderie over the last 14 years. I don't think I had a bad word from any one of you. To the members that are, that are leaving or retiring from Parliament next March, I wish you all good health and may you have a long, healthy and happy life. For the members who are continuing on the good fight, may I wish you all the best of luck next year in all your future endeavours. Mr Speaker, to you and the members of this House, farewell and may the good Lord smile down upon every one of you. It has been truly an honour and a privilege to have served with you as a member of the New South Wales Parliament. Mr Speaker, in accordance with the resolution of the House, I table the Ranbow speech to be incorporated in Hansard. Thank you and farewell. <laughs>